So I had this insane game, and I had to highlight it, but I wasn't sure which part to highlight, so screw the rules. I don't have money, unfortunately, but screw the rules. I decided to make this video a little bit longer than a minute to highlight all of the ridiculousness that happened during this game. So starting right off, uh, I was 2v1 bot lane as Braum support, I'm a pretty tanky support, mind you. Braum has the ability to block a lot of damage with his shield and gain so much resistances, uh, but he can't really farm very well, so I obviously wasn't able to do anything with the misfortune disconnecting, unfortunately, never really getting into the game until much, much later in the game. Uh, and I ended up getting tower dive very early on in the game, and I ended up trading one for one, which on its own, I was like, ah, oh, that'll, that'll be a great moment, surviving a 2v1 lane and getting a kill out of it. Obviously, though, I'm still 2v1, uh, so getting pushed in really hard, I decided to try and counter the push with a ZZ Rod portal, and it was at this point that the enemies just seemed to stop pushing. I get the feeling that they were, like, hiding in bushes a lot, because every once in a while, like, three people would come up, like, out of nowhere at mid lane, and they were always hovering around mid lane, but they couldn't seem to get, like, a proper push on us. I don't know what happened, but once they got, like, to the tier 2, they just kept staying mid, and the game just elongated much longer than they needed it to be. And I think that was, like, an amazing downfall. Like, they just couldn't do anything for whatever reason, or they... It's not that they couldn't, it's that they didn't. They didn't bother trying to fight the ZZ Rock portal. At this point, I started reading all chat, and I, I guess the Malzahar was trolling. Um, he did end up just kind of walking into us, feeding kills, so... Yeah, shout out to this guy, honor him, because this is ranked. And the fact that you're just able to be like, you know what, these guys have a disconnect, I'm just gonna take pity on them, or I don't know, maybe he didn't get the role he wanted, you know? Who knows why people troll these days, but I'll take it, man. This does not mean I condone trolling, by the way, this is just a just side note. Uh, please don't troll in your games. So anyways, Misfortune reconnects and we say, hey, go bottom, catch this giant wave and just, like, get some experience. And then, like, this team fight breaks out and... This is probably one of my favorite moments in this game. She starts trying to like deal damage to Renekton. She does absolutely nothing. Like I'm pretty sure Renekton didn't even feel the damage. Kind of puts into perspective how fighting Godzilla would have gone if you were just a puny little human who didn't actually wear any armor but instead came to battle in like like with a midriff and like two tiny ass peanut guns that probably were used by Diddy Kong before you. At the end of the game we won, we pushed harder than them, and we got so many towers, and it was like, wait, we, wh how, what, <laughs> so much of this game was spent 4v5 with Misfortune in the base, it, like, my mind was literally blown, uh, so, yeah, moral of the story, never give up, and, uh, cross your fingers that your enemy jungler just feeds.